welcome back to my channel so for today's video we're gonna be doing get ready with me to take some pictures because your girl needs to take some pictures because i saw this aesthetically pleasing photo like on pictures i was going around like you were like a jumpsuit or you were like a matching set like a hoodie and joggers and then it looks super cute you just take pictures and it's just like matching so i do have a set that i just recently got from hollister that my boyfriend bought me for christmas so i think i was gonna take some cute photos with that so i'm just gonna get ready with y'all plain white t-shirt on that i got from Target and I'm wearing my blue joggers but I'll show you in a little bit when I'm done with my makeup. So I just washed my face. I think I'm going to put chungle in my hair. So I'm just going to put chungle in my hair so I can put all my hair back. And I think I'm doing a little pony like this but more like nicey looking and I can put some gel because it's that time to wash my hair. I'm going to do like a really sleek low ponytail and it looks so fire. So first off I'm going to start off with Ultra Facial Cream by Kiehl's and it's the one with some sunscreen in because it's always good to have some sunscreen in your moisturizer because you don't want to have wrinkles or bad skin when you get older. So I always got to have moisturizer with sunscreen in the morning. So I'm just going to put the, I'm not just going to apply this all over my face and my neck. <laughs> So next we're going to be using my e.l.f. putty primer. So I'm going to use my e.l.f. poreless putty primer. And I'm going to put this on my T-zone. And I really love this product. And you can tell I went ham in. I'm already hitting bottom. And so I like to put it on my nose, chin, and my forehead. And then what I left over I have on my hands. I just go around my cheek. Because sometimes I accidentally put too much. So yeah, I really like this because it's lightweight. And it gives me a really smooth face. So next we're going to do is some brows. I went back with the Anastasia dip brow. I know, I know, I said that. I was going to just stick with powder brows. But like, I went to try this one more time. And I looked it again. So what I do is I kind of like, kind of spray in here a little bit with water. I'll have less product. I'm going to spray. Just a little wet. So less product on my brush. Because I don't want my eyebrows really harsh. But then I don't want too light. So I'm just going to clean them off in my handy nanny mirror and i'm just gonna brush up my brow so all i do is i just dip my brush like this tap it and i get in here and then the water kind of takes off all of my product I just got done doing my eyebrows. This takes a while, so I don't really talk when I do my eyebrows because I really try to concentrate even as possible. For foundation, I guess I'm gonna use I think I'm gonna use my NYX Can't Stop Bone Stop Foundation because it's like really my go-to. And typically this is like my only shade that actually matches me at the moment. For the bottom of my eyebrows that I concealed is the Born This Way Concealer and then top of my brows I use the Makeup Forever HD Stick. I like to use this on top because it's a thicker consistency. Consistent consistency <laughs> thicker consistency. So I like this. I use that. I mean my hands look like my hands feel really dirty. So this makeup look is really my go-to. Oh, a little update. I just bought some clothes from Shein and I'm pretty excited. Hopefully they fit me. I try to look at reviews and sizing. So I bought a lot of clothes and I bought some purses. I bought some um accessories and a little bit of jewelry so i'm pretty excited for that because i've really been wanting to try sheen clothes for a very long time because i only bought one thing in there i think it was last year i just bought a bathing suit but i really want to try the clothing and i see like on pinterest and then i see on instagram how trendy they are and i really want to try them so i just got a little bit of everything you know so i'm pretty excited and happy and then i'll be doing a haul for y'all and y'all are gonna love it so i'm just gonna do this all over my face <laughs> The shade I'm using is medium olive. And we just hit 1.3k and I'm so happy. We're almost there. My goal this month is to hit 5k subscribers. I know it seems a lot, but I can do it. Just imagine. 5k subscribers and more. Oh, I can do it. We can do it. I really want to hit 100k subscribers this year. I can just feel it. I really want to hit it. By the end of this year, I can do it. I know I can do it. Just imagine the plaque. Take a moment real quick. Let's just imagine.
I know you do. We can hit it. See, I use a blonde way to even up my skin a little bit. So I'm going to use my Laura Mercedes powder for all of my face. And I use my little Real Techniques powder sponge for only under my eyes. And then I'm going to get a powder brush. Just my Peaches and Cream. Uh, PCO4. And just pat it everywhere to give me a finished look. I recently was starting to use my MAC Studio Fix Powder that were like my face powders when I was like really, really dark. So I thought maybe this can give me a sun-kissed look without just a too harsh of a brown on my skin. But I'm going to do a little bit of NARS on my cheeks just a tad bit, but this is going to be mainly like my bronzer. <laughs> You see what it gives me? Like that nice orange look. I like that. I don't know, I'm just feeling it. And just, I just started like, hmm, I wonder if I can use these as my bronzers. And plus they're a studio finish powder, so it's very smooth on the face. <laughs> Just to tan me up a little bit. So I'm gonna go in with my NARS one and I'm just gonna do a light and just keep it on the outside now. Don't bring it in. And just, just like that. We're gonna bake a little, just a little bit under. Just a little bit so I can look a little sharp. Lightly powder. Just lightly blush. I'm going to be using my Wet n Wild Nudist Society. This is really pretty. I like this one. It's kind of like the dupe as the Milani Luminoso. So all I keep this is really high where my highlighter goes. And it really uplifts your face. And I really like that about that. So I've been really doing that. Just keeping it way up here in my blush. So look how high my cheeks look. Like look at that. That's what I'm going for. And I really see we all learn something new every day with makeup. And then I'll go my nose. And then I'll go my forehead, my chin, just everywhere so it look blended. Okay, so now we're gonna just take a little bit of the powder off my face. And then we're just gonna spray my face just to keep it hydrated and like make all the powders blend in. Ooh, that feels amazing. I love this one. I love when the Morphe Smith spray so gradually and like oh. So now what we're gonna do for highlighter, I'm gonna use my Milani um, Sun Glow. Really high up here, just a light. Just something very light. Right about up there. See, nothing too crazy. A little brush and do my inner corner eyebrow bone. And I'm gonna do a little bit on above my eyebrows, just a little light. And then my chin. This like, looks so glowy. So we are basically doing like the whole beat. We're just gonna do clear on my mascara on my eyebrows. I need to really get a new one for my eyebrows because I'm running out. And then for eyelashes today, we're gonna be doing very natural ones. So these are my Dollar Tree ones. I'll show you in a little bit. But for mascara, I'm gonna use my Bad Girl Bang from Benefit, and I'm just gonna curl them real quick so I can match my. Eyelashes because I don't like when they're like straight and then my lashes are very curled up. That does not look right, boo boo. I think I'm gonna put a little bit of um eyeliner. I'm gonna do a little bit of my brown one. There's a little brown liner just cover up the lash line just in case. And I like the brown look because it's very soft and it goes with my makeup look. So now I'm just gonna put some mascara on. like that so while that dries up i'm going to take out these things on my hair brush my hair out and then we're going to do my hair and then we're going to do our lashes and then we're going to do our lip and then we're going to put our jacket on and we're going to be good to go for pictures oh my god look at my hair i look so i'm going to brush out my hair my hair has been growing so long i haven't cut it in two years since I think when I started my channel, my hair, I just cut it. So, y'all see my hair grown very long. My hair is so long. I love it and hate it because my, I get headaches. I get headaches really bad. And it looks really cute with long hair. So, so okay. Straighten out my hair. Okay, to achieve the style, <laughs> you want to have a very straight line. Um, 
a straight parting line in your hair. Okay, mine looks almost straight, honestly. Okay, I'm gonna leave it as straight as that. It doesn't need no drop, but yeah, you just wanna parting it really straight. Looks like I have some hair missing. There you go. <laughs> um, hair style look, it's really stunning. I actually like it. Some people think they'll look funny because, you know, you look kind of like, <gasps> but it's honestly like so pretty. I saw this like on Pinterest. I saw this on Instagram. I see like some YouTubers I watch, they do hairstyles like this. I usually do hairstyles like this, but not like very, like, really straight and out there. I should probably put my jacket on first, right? <gasps> I should put it on because if I don't, my hair is me still brushing my hair even though I just said I'm gonna put Should I put my jacket on? Because I'll get messed up. Dang it. Okay, I'm putting this in a low tone hole. And then we're gonna get right back to it. I'm gonna put my hoodie on so my hair won't get messed up. Because I'm gonna take pictures. So this is my hoodie. It's this pretty blue set. And this is like the men's. As it says Hollister. It's super cute. The matching joggers. So I'm just gonna put this on. The camera died. So, so I'm gonna put this hoodie on. I hope it don't get hot. I have all these lights on in my room. Yeah, if I didn't, if I did my hair already, my hair would be messed up. And I almost got my eyebrow. I think I got my forehead. Ooh, look at me. I really like this color of my skin. So, back to my hair. I don't know if I'm gonna be using one trunk or two because I just got new trunks. So they're pretty tight. So, I'm gonna pick up my sleeves because they're probably gonna get hot. So, I'm gonna keep doing my hair. I think I should put some, I should put some styling glue in it. I'm gonna put a little bit in my hands. And then massaging my hands, and then just. Ooh, and my hands, ugh, this stick straight and no little fizzies come out. So that's what I did. And I'm gonna get my brush and really flatten it more down. See how it looks so nice? Oh my god, it looks so good. And this is a great hairstyle to do when your hair is like dirty and you don't know what hairstyle to do. You can just do this and put gel and you can just wash it right after. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my trunk on. Okay, oh, it's hot. <laughs> All these lights on my face. Oh, girl, I need a slushy from Sonic, honestly. Okay, see, my hair is really straight. This is hairstyle to do when you need to wash your hair like this day and you don't know what hairstyle to do, just do this. It's really cute. You might look like a little egg, but you know, just try it. You'll like it. Just try it. So now I'm going to put the rest of them. I'm going to put my lashes on since my mascara is dry now. We're going to do a lipstick. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what lipstick to do. And then jewelry. Ooh, which jewelry should I put on? I don't know if you can hear them. They have the conjuring on. You don't like scaring. Oh my god, I just got glue on my jewelry. Love that. Dang it. Um, we have a conjuring on if you don't like scary movies. Boo boo. I love scary movies, so we have that on right now. Um, I like this look. Look, my nail boos are so cute. If you haven't watched my recent video, I just did a 24 hour transformation glow up. And you know, I did my nail. I did a hair mask. I did a face mask. Fish with my doll. And my dog looks scared, but that's okay. Because she always looks like that when I take pictures with her. <laughs> Honestly, I'm like, Marty Ray, chill. She's a weird. I think it's allergies outside. And she was like all panicking. I'm like, I'm just taking a picture with you. So she's your eyes all watery and like, oh my god. I have this NYX liquid suede one, but I think this is too dark. I'm always indecisive. And my LA color pencils are my go to one because. I want to do a liquid lip. So I'm going to do this lip liner. It's the cafe one. LA girl. I think I'm gonna do my dose of colors. This is the shade Knock on Wood. This is a really good color. So I'm gonna lip line my lips. When you fall in a and once in a while, Prince Charming don't smile. In fact, you won't show up at all. So you and I should be human beings. Okay, lip line my lips and I kind of overline. But that's okay. So let's see if this color does good. This better be really cute on my lips because. Oh, yeah, it's cute. It's cute. Okay, that looks good. 
looks really good. Oh yeah, super cute. Why haven't I worn this color? <gasps> Look at that nude. <gasps> Lip liner, Cafe Family Girl, Dose of Colors, Knock on Wood. And this is like, that is cute. So this is my outfit. I really like it. Stylish. <gasps> yeah, see, see, don't mind that stain right there. Um, That's where I got the eyelash glue, but see, it has Hollister right here. I really like this set. I like how my boyfriend, this is like a men set. I got the smallest size and it fits me really nice and I really like this color and it, it really suits my skin tone and then my hair is really long guys look how long my hair is these studs I got them from Walmart I think they were like three dollars they're like the biggest ones I think I mean wore my name necklace I honestly don't know where my mom got this I know I get a lot of questions about this but I honestly don't know where my mom got it I had this for a very long time since I think I was 14 and it was a Christmas gift that my mom gave to my sister and I. It's, I know this is very expensive. It wasn't like cheap. Like you can get like on Amazon or somewhere. If you haven't already, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. It oh, means so much to me and for my channel. I appreciate it a lot. So I'm going to put my air fresh on real quick. I love these are my go-to shoes. I have Fila's. I can put Fila. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my outfit. It looks super cute. Can't wait to take some pictures. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!